Well, boys and girls, ladies and gents, we have a new event here today. It is Friday, first of all, so super jacked up about that. I was able to go dirt biking yesterday, so you gotta love that as well. Super excited to be uh, back in the mountains again. Uh, we have a couple of chests we're just gonna open up because these are the some of the sweetest chests in all of Clash Royale. But more importantly, we're gonna get into this double elixir, it looks like, draft challenge. Um, the main reason they're doing this bad boy, holy crap, is because of the gold. That is insane. The, an insane amount of gold. So, let's see how well we do. Maybe we'll play a few battles, maybe a few more. Who knows? Who knows what we're going to do here today. So, I will take the Executioner. Might as well. And, of course, I'm going to take the Graveyard because that's what I've been playing with. Um, unfortunately, I don't know what I'm going to take here. I probably will play the Zap just because... Um, you know, why not? And then, since I took the zap, I am going to take Mr. Lumberjack. Alright, give him Sparky, see what he does with that. Hopefully he doesn't mirror Sparky on us and make us look a fool. A fool, I tell ya. Alright, back at it. Okay, so we have, um, looks like Baby Dragon. He gave us some goblins. What else did he give us? So I will put Executioner on this side, just to defend against his Sparky. Oh, we have Ice Spirit as well. This is fantastic. And he's going to mirror Sparky right off the bat. I don't know that that is the best play for him, but I will take it anyway. Oh my gosh, I didn't think he was going to be able to get the Executioner with that shot, but he sure did. Um, we're going to... What the... F where are you going, witch? Like, where are... Like, honestly. Where... Honestly. Honestly, where are you going? All right, here we go. That's okay. We did pretty good there, I guess. He had double Sparky. I lost two executioners in that battle I lost what else did I lose that was horrible absolutely horrible and he got a balloon to the tower unfortunately for us gosh dang that was crazy oh it's double elixir no I'm like why is there so much why is there so much elixir coming on the map here uh, that makes a lot more sense so okay double elixir guys <laughs> focus I'm like why why is everything going so fast I thought it was speedy deedy Okay, so he was able to mirror his Sparky. Um, we are going to put a defensive front up against that. Zap that balloon and... What? I thought... No! Don't hit my witch! Man, that Sparky started... It seems to be charging up a little bit faster. I don't know why, but it seems to be doing pretty well. Um, he's up on us on tower damage. And boy, I'll tell you what. I'm going to send Lumberjack and a Graveyard in there. See if we can just take this tower out real quick because he's doing a number on us. Oh yeah, we got this tower in the bag now. It is over for him. Uh, we'll do that and then we'll do a nice little ice spirit. We'll do some spear gobs and then we will uh, we'll do another Sparky hit there. Boom! There we go. Take care of Sparky. Oh no, that's gonna take care of my witch. Dang it! Those all oh, those skeletons were clutch for us, guys. Real clutch. We were able to take out Sparky finally. Gosh, I cannot believe how bad I'm doing with this deck. Okay, all right, fair enough. We'll do that. We'll do that. We'll put a baby dragon up there, and then hopefully we can get a graveyard down here um, just to make all that action go away. That tornado is doing a number on us. It is doing a number on us. Okay, uh, excellent fireball on his part. I'll take that. I'll take that in stride. That was good. Uh, we'll freeze a little ice spirit action. What he's get? He's got. Oh yeah, he's got that balloon. We gotta hurry up and do something about that balloon, and then hopefully he doesn't get a fireball off um, in time. I don't think a fireball is even gonna do it for him, even if he does get it off. So that worked out well. We did. We won that one. That was excellent. Do we get some gold yet? No, we don't. We get gold two wins, right? Two wins in. We get like four thousand gold. Holy crap! Ooh, crown chest. Let's go open that first. Prince. Dang it. I don't use Prince. Alright, let's get back into another battle. Might as well here. We're doing draft challenge time. Draft challenge. Um, Goblin Gang, of course. <laughs> of course. Um, hmm. That's tough. I'm going to take E-Wiz. I'm going to take E-Wiz, and then I'm going to take... <sighs> I got the Mortar because I got the E-Wiz to reset the Tesla, and then we will take the Goblin Barrel just to throw it in his face because he's got Elixir Collector. We should be able to take that out with the Goblin Barrel, right? I think so. I think so. Oh, Dark Goblin. So we got a Goblin deck. A Fancy Pants Goblin deck. 
Uh, we're going to drop two archers right here in the back. The most annoying play in the game. Um, uh, we're going to have to put a Goblin Gang up there. And then I'll throw a little bit deep barrel. Because he's out of elixir a little bit. Boom, boom. We'll zap that. Boom, boom. We should be able to take... Holy cow! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, that was super fun. That's going to be fun to deal with. Uh, okay, no big deal. We'll put a little Dark Goblin action back here. Should take out those uh, guards really quick. No problem. And then we'll put... Uh, man, we got another Goblin game coming our way. We'll put a Goblin Barrel on that Elixir Collector so he doesn't build up any type of advantage. And then we will go ahead and fireball all that action. Take that out of the field. Um, we're doing pretty good. I think we're on fire here. We're not doing too bad at all. We're going to have to put uh, that down. And then we'll put that down. And then we will put that down just to zap all that away. Uh, Goblin Gang surround his little prince there. I don't care about it. Ain't no thing but a chicken wing right there. Uh, we'll put a little def defensive-ish mortar up there. See if we can't get that going. Dude, I love this double elixir. Absolutely loving it. Oh, crap. 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 Uh, it's reset. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I kind of screwed up. I'll be honest. I screwed up. I screwed up big. Luckily, our mortar was focused over there. Gosh, I screwed up so bad. Uh, we're going to put another uh, mortar right here. Goblin gang right there. And then we'll put a dark goblin right there. <laughs> this is so crazy. Double lick. It's so fast when it's the whole game. You know, you're used to it for like one minute. But once you play the whole game with the double elixir, dude, it's like a whole different ball game. We'll throw that on the tower there. Um, come on, come on, come on. And then take that pump out. That's all I want, really. We'll put that... Uh, Put that there. Uh, I'm gonna have to fireball that, and then we'll put a goblin gang there. Come on, focus on my goblins. There you go. Um, dark goblin up there. Take care of that. He's slowly, slowly poisoning us to death, and it's kind of hurting my feelings here. Oh, that was excellent, excellent. Um, no, nah, that's useless. That's good fireball though, if you ask me. Come on, fireball that. Both pumps and that. Boom, boom. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. That was good play on his part. Good play, good play. Zap, zap. We just can't let that prince get to our tower because that would be embarrassing on every level of the game. Dude, I love this deck. I might keep this deck, this is awesome. Uh, we'll put some archers here for defense. A defensive mortar. And then a defensive goblin gang. All kinds of defense just to frustrate the beans out of him. And guess what, ladies and gentlemen? We get some gold. Okay. <laughs> we get some gold. <laughs> Dude, I'm so excited. This is the best challenge ever. Because uh, the biggest shortage in the game, obviously, is the gold. And so, them giving this this gold, this much gold, is absolutely spectacular. What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? 4,000 gold? I'll take it. Put that in the coffer, all right? Let's get into another battle. Dude, okay. So, what we're going to take here, we're going to take the... Uh, we're going to take... Ooh, ooh, ooh. We're going to take the log. We are. We're going to take the log. Dang it! Uh... I'm going to have to take three musketeers because I have nothing to defend against them right now as it sits. I will take the I'll take the free spell since I have the log for the goblin barrel. And then I will take the I'll take the hut. I don't like the tesla at all. So, oof. Not loving the deck yet, not really loving it. Um four musketeer Pekka deck. That's actually a real deck, guys. So we'll put Musketeer down for this. Uh, we'll go ahead and log that. No problem. That was a waste of a lightning. Um, so in, just because he did lightning, I'm going to go ahead. And as soon as he puts one more troop on the map. Oh, no. Nope, i got to do it now. We're going to have to do that now. And then I will go ahead and freeze all that action. Dang it. Dang it. Oh, man. That would have been so sweet if I would have done something correct. Oh, that was horrible. Horrible! Oh my gosh, this is going to be so ugly. So ugly. I'm waiting for that goblin barrel. Okay, okay. We didn't do too bad of defense since I screwed up absolutely royally. Oh man, I'm leaking elixir. Okay. Um, we're going to split the musketeers this time in the back instead of putting them at the bridge. That was a, probably the dumbest play of my life. So we'll do that. I uh, put the skeletons up just to trigger that uh, Tesla so my princess would shoot it a little bit. And then we will put a P.E.K.K.A over here. I'm not sure what he has uh, for that. But 
Oh my gosh, I keep flipping doing that. We're going to go ahead and log all that away. Now we got to push up over here that's going to be definitely... It's going to be troubling to deal with, okay, to say the least. He's going to have to deal with it. He's going to have to do something. Hopefully we can get that P.E.K.K.A. there. Um, unfortunately, it did not get there, but my Musketeer is doing more work than I had ever hoped for. So I'm definitely okay with that. We're going to put three Musketeers here on defense. Um, we should be able to log a little bit of that action away. There we go. And then we'll put a princess up uh, here. Kind of a defensive princess on that side. No big deal. I don't know what he's doing, but good for him. I'm proud of him. Uh, those three musketeers are going to do a ton of damage. We'll drop a P.E.K.K.A. right here on the bridge in just a second. Um, or should we go for the three crown? I'm going to drop P.E.K.K.A. in the middle of the base. Because <laughs> that should be fun. Um, we'll go ahead and log that away. The princess is going to take out the tower by herself pretty much, guys. One hit on that should take care of that. And then we got three musketeers up again. We do. <laughs> so we'll drop some skeletons. Good defense. He just can't get anything off. This double elixir with this deck. So take heavy cards. Once you go into double elixir, I mean, you might as well take some hit. What did he hit us with? Oh, he lightning. He must have lightning while I was closing my eyes. I just want to get that other tower. I want to get it so badly. Um, let's freeze all that just for fun. <laughs> okay. That was awesome. So we got three wins. Three wins in a row. Keep it up, guys. Uh, super fun challenge definitely if you guys have not played it yet get in there and get it done draft with the best of them uh your draft is going to make the biggest difference in your game of course we got some great things coming up please subscribe to the channel leave some comments and some likes below and good luck